Goods transported by road in the UK must be secured properly in order to protect the driver and other road users. To make sure that the load is secure, DVSA examiners can look at how a vehicle or trailer has been loaded as part of a roadworthiness inspection at the roadside. DVSA examiners are looking for the answers to four questions. Can the load slide forward or backwards? Can the load slide sideways? Whether the load can topple over and either fall from the vehicle or make the vehicle unstable? Is there anything loose that could fall from the vehicle? The load securing system should be strong enough to prevent the load from shifting under normal driving conditions. This includes heavy braking or when the vehicle is turning. The load securing system can consist of one or more of the vehicle or trailer structure, restraints like lashings or chains, other measures like chocks or blocking. Some things are not part of the load securing system. The curtain of a standard curtain sided trailer is for weather protection only and it should not be used to secure the load. Some trailers are built to the reinforced XL standard. These trailers can be used without additional securing for most loads and work best with loads that fill the load bed. They're supplied with a test certificate that explains how they should be used. The headboard of the vehicle or trailer is a key component of the load securing system. If possible, it's best to load against the headboard so that the load can't start to slide forward under heavy braking. If the load has to be loaded away from the headboard, you should use additional securing to make sure the load can't start to slide. This could be empty pallets or timbers placed into the gap between the load and the headboard, more lashings over the load or chocks underneath the load. Examiners will look at the condition of the equipment used to secure the loads. Webbing straps that are damaged or worn will not be as strong as new straps and could pull apart if the load starts to move. Headboards that are damaged or heavily corroded might not be strong enough to prevent a shifting load moving forward. If some or all of a load comes through the headboard, it could go into the driver's cab. Loose items, including securing equipment that isn't being used, should be stowed so it can't fall from the vehicle. It's important to make sure loads are stable. Lashings alone shouldn't be relied on for unstable loads, as the load could collapse or topple when the lashings are removed during unloading. Having as much information about the load and how it's been secured as possible can help examiners quickly decide whether the load is safe or not. If the driver has not been involved in loading, a loading docket or load plan can show what the load is, how much the load weighs, how the load has been secured. When the examiner has all the information they need, they will make a decision about whether the load is safe to continue or not. If the vehicle is not safe to continue its journey, the DVSA examiner will issue a prohibition notice and a graduated fixed penalty ticket to the driver. The vehicle must not be moved until it's made safe. If it can't be made safe in a timely fashion, it could be immobilized. Load shifts can have devastating consequences for drivers and other road users. The checks DVSA carry out at the roadside help to keep UK roads safe for everyone.